Good morning, gamers. Welcome back. I'm still in my search of homebrew items, and I found one that seems interesting. I am the AMDM Lee. This is my cup of coffee, and you're watching How Do You Want to Brew This? All right, so I'm searching through the homebrew items, and this one has caught my attention. One, because it's, uh, it only has one point, one rating. It's been voted on one time. So I want to either give it some love or give it some hurt. So we either gonna I'm gonna we either gonna have this upvoted or voted down. The item itself is called the 52 second coin, and I'm not sure exactly how I feel about it. It was created by Raccoon Batman 57 of uh, just a few days ago. February 10th, I say a few days ago, granted, uh, not too long ago, and this is a wondrous item. Well, here, just look at it for yourself. So, here we go. It is a wondrous item, the 52-second coin, very rare, wondrous item, wondrous item, very rare, raccoon, Batman 57, it's been viewed 130 times, had two ads, no comments, and a plus one rating. This is a cursed item. It is a gold coin that has a number 52 embedded on it. Individuals must make a charisma saving throw. If failed, but see, it doesn't give me what the what the um, difficulty is. Uh, if failed, individuals are stuck in a time bubble for 52 seconds. After 52 seconds have passed, they go back into time and repeat the last 52 seconds. They have five chances to break this spell. Uh, oh, five charisma saving throws, and after five failed attempts, they are permanently stuck in a time loop, forever to repeat the last five rounds of life. Forever. This could be interesting. Uh, I'm not sure. I would, I would, hmm. I don't know how I would, if I would find this interest, useful or not. The, it needs a saving throw. It needs to know the difficulty. But as a DM, you can change that up yourself. You can make it a, a simple one. Or um, a hard, complex, whatever. So they, they must make a, a, a charisma saving throw. If they fail, they're stuck in the bubble for 52 seconds. After that time passes, they go back in time and repeat the last 52 seconds. So... Does that mean the time that they're in the bubble, they... It, it could be useful. Um... Say you're in the middle of combat and you, and it goes off and you you have it, then that means the last five rounds, you get to change the outcome of. You get to change what has happened in the last five rounds of combat. Because you're changing probability. So this actually, I think this is, this will be something that I think is really interesting and maybe a little OP in some instances but then they have the five chances to break the spell which I don't know why this person chose the five chances to break the spell the five saving throws and the five failed attempts or the five save the five the five saving throws um forever repeat the last five rounds of 
of uh, life. That that doesn't make any sense to me. But I could say if uh, if you made the saving throw extremely low, and maybe I wouldn't necessarily make this a cursed item. This could be a really useful item, similar to uh, a luck coin where they get to re-roll the last few seconds. I do kind of like this. Uh, I would change it up 52 seconds. That's a full minute. That's almost a minute. Might as well say it's the, the 60 second coin. Which I think would be a little more interesting. Um, or the 30 second coin. Because now you're talking five rounds, five rounds, six seconds. That should be a 30 second coin. Uh, there's there's some things I could do with it. But you know what? All in all, uh, I think I'm going to vote this one up with some tweaks. Hey, you never know. It's It seems like it, it, it has potential. So Raccoon Batman, you're getting a vote up for me because it has potential. And... We'll see where it goes from there. So you guys tell me. What do you think? Do you think it's good as it is? Do you think it should be voted up? Voted down? What would you change about it? How would you use this in your game? And how would you change it if it showed up? That's all I got for now, guys. If you like these videos, please click on the like button. If you think someone else would like them, please click on the share button. Every like's an inspiration. Every share is an advantage. And every subscription is an experience point. Help me gain 300 experience points so I can get to second level. And as always, the AMDM does hereby authorize you, the viewer, to gain 10 experience points for every video that you share. Just tell your DM the AMDM said so. That's all I've got for now, so go forth and roll some dice.